Hi guys, it's me here. Pooh Bear 253. And I'm here with Mr. Alex. And I'm getting him dressed with some Halloween gear. And I just wanted to just have you guys here hang out with me um like i say today i took the day off of work because i just felt mentally drained and just needed just a little r and r time i hope you can hear me okay think he'll probably wear this little outfit because I have the slippers to go with it. They're in here somewhere. So, I, well, because I'm always so busy, I don't really get to see what's going on or what's going on in the Reborn community and everything. And there is like some serious stuff going on in the community involving like tiny magical creatures I've been seeing videos and it just baffles and confuses me about you know somebody being in a community doing giveaways in a community but has so many harsh things to say about the people in that community so it just confuses me like, um, I had recently noticed some of the not so very nice things that she's had to say about some people in the community, and I, uh, decided to unsubscribe from her because of that, because, you know, no one needs that negativity, you know, saying mean and hurtful things that, you know, just because that's not the type of person I am and I don't want to watch or see comments of mean things to people because it's just not right and notice some videos come up on Lexi and which means if Lexi made a video that means tiny magical creatures had made a video so I went back on her channel to check out the videos and so it's like I just think that's a battle that just is not going to be won um, and I know I just received a package from her and this was before I knew all of the things that had been said Like right before I saw the things, so so I don't know. It's just kind of weird. There, so there's just been some some stuff going on, some not very happy stuff going on. So this is already like in there. It's two shirts that came with this. It says "Mommy's Little Monster." So I figured I could use this time to um, just have some quiet nursery time. And stuff, so I don't know. 
At this point, I'm not even sure if I'm going to put this video up. I just wanted to dress a few of the babies and I need to go relax while I still have some time to relax. So, of course, since I'm home, of course, I'm not going to be making it to the gym today. And I've just been feeling just kind of off my game the last few days and I honestly can't wait to get my rhythm back oh my back hurts oh Whew. I need support for my back and this chair does not offer much of that I'm trying to tighten this up Oh, it doesn't offer very much back support at all. It's just this mesh thing, and it just gives you no support. It just hurts my back. That's what happens when you get old, ladies. having all these issues when I was young. A younger, because I'm not old or anything. <clears throat> Waiting on the mail lady. Hopefully, what I'm waiting for comes today, because that will be great. I won't have to worry about stopping by the post office dealing with that. So, like I said, I just needed a relaxation day. And I'm getting it right here in this nursery. And I just found uh, another video from a lady... It is a fallen. I don't remember. It was another lady that was weighing in on the whole tiny magical creatures. Because me, I usually just stay out of things. I try not to get involved because it just sucks so much time and energy out of you. And I usually stay away from that type of stuff because, you know, life in general sucks enough of my energy and I just don't need anything else sucking the life out of me but I don't know I just wish there could be a truce and I just wish they can just be left alone my baby this hand is pretty okay. Still coming off a little bit. Mr. Alex. Like I said in a previous video, he's losing a little paint on the tips of his fingers. But he's an older baby. And that type of stuff happens. I'm just going to keep his white socks on. I'm finding my hat. Let's see what we have here. It says Mommy's Little Monster. I can... I got these clearance like last a while ago. It's not the same kind of monster. I have a pumpkin hat that I got from Carter's. I have this little witch hat. Let's go put on put this on one of the girls. I was probably gonna put this on Aria. And I have a kitty cat that I got from Carter's. Also, like I said, this green doesn't exactly match. I'll try it on just to see what it looks like. I'll put up those scissors, Dorn. I'm going to have to try it on later. Oh, my phone is charged. Oh. 
hate having to do that. I'm just kind of sitting by the window to kind of watch, watch out for the male lady, because we know how the male people can be. They'll pass you up without even attempting to deliver. Um, sometimes I wish that I didn't have to work for a living. I wish I could just sit and play in my nursery. At least once a week, you know. Or something like that. Because any of my downtime, like I'm, sh you know, you know, during the week, there is no downtime, Monday through Friday. I'm working, I'm at the gym, the weekend, it's housework, cooking and cleaning, and yard work and things like that. And then it's just right back to the week again, you know. You just, just don't get any free time hardly at all. You end up having to take time off of work just to get a breather from life sometimes. And sometimes I'm just so drained. Like lately, I'm just so drained. Just saying, please just stop for a minute, just for a minute, so I could catch my breath, so I can catch up. But it never listens, and eventually you just have to take a mental health day, and just burn one of your days. It's not something you have to do very often, but sometimes I just have to do that. Oh, Mr. Alex. Now you guys probably can't really see that great. I have my, but I keep looking and that's my Halloween little container, all my Halloween stuff. It's really just a box. Ever since I've put Alex's new body on him, he is just such a chunk. And I just love his chunky little body. He's such a chunk. All right. I'm wondering. Like I said, I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to do his hair. This one smells so good. This is the one that makes Minnie's peanut, mini peanuts hair bleed. If I put a little baby oil in it, it smells so good though. I heard from Minnie Peanuts artists that brushing the hair dry is bad so lately I've been making sure I spray the hair before I brush it now I just kind of brush over it and then I comb through it to get the little kinks out or whatever But yeah, that whole tiny magical creatures thing has me baffled. 
This is really confusing. You know, she says be kind, and yet she does the opposite and she says mean things. I just don't get it. I guess there are just things in this world that you just aren't meant to get. I just don't understand. Like I say, you just don't want to get involved, mostly. But it just ends up bad. You just don't even want to get involved. And see, once you spread and brush over it, it makes it easier to comb. And the comb just kind of glides through the hair. It just glides straight through. I ordered my little princess's hair a couple days ago. And she's going to have some Slumberland mohair. And the mohair, oh, I can't remember. I think Emily and Alex, they have the same mohair. Oh, I can't remember. What was the other good mohair? There's Slumberland, and there's another, I can't remember. My hubby calls Alex the hipster because he has his thick hair. He said he just needs some glasses. And I was always scared about wetting my reborn's hair a lot. Now I hear that you should only it once you've sprayed it it's always something different you never know what to do <laughs> and this is the fun for me just combing their hair, getting them dressed. Like I said, I'm not big on the role playing and everything. But like I said, everybody, to each his own, everybody has their own thing. That's what makes our community so cool, you know. Not everybody does the same thing. Not everyone... makes their video the same way. Ooh. I have an alarm that's going off. Let me go deal with that real quick. Be right back. Alright, so we're back. And I was just kind of chatting with myself as I was walking. And I was saying how I just feel so foreign being home, knowing I'm not supposed to be home, knowing that I was supposed to be at work or whatever. And I was just saying to myself how you just have to know yourself and take care of yourself mentally because no one else is going to do it for you. You got to do it yourself. I'm kind of concerned about this 
me using this with this baby oil. I might need to stop using this. Cause like Alex's ears are all shiny. From it. I'm gonna have to start using the other. I think I should trash this. I think I am. Cause I can feel the all on it. I just feel that probably can't be very good. So let's switch back to this one. Like I just don't like for their vinyl to get wet. I just don't like that at all. Cause it makes me nervous. I try to dab it, not rub. It makes me nervous about like paint getting ruined and such. This makes me very nervous. A neighbor just like put mail in my mailbox. I'm wondering, that was kind of strange. I don't know if something got misdelivered or what. I've never seen that car before. what that was I think I need to go check my mail that was just kind of weird I don't know that was my mail or what I tell you I shouldn't do videos like this because when some when I'm doing my baby's hair like, I forget to talk. I'm just trying to make their hair look nice. That's all I'm really thinking about is getting their hair to look nice. And I kind of like Alex's hair to look kind of wild because it's so thick. So I kind of try to spruce it up to it kind so that it looks messy but messy combed messy so <laughs> so I'm sorry for not talking I think I should probably go ahead and just end this video I'm about to go check my mail because I'm like kind of concerned because somebody just like pulled up and just put mail in my mailbox it's kind of weirding me out but I'm just assuming somebody that just got our mail by accident we've done that before too that's what a you know a nice neighbor does is they get your mail by accident just put it in your mailbox and be through with it okay let's see I guess this is good. I think this I'm gonna throw away. Cause it just makes me kind of nervous. And I don't know why I've used it for so long. Cause usually I barely put anything on my baby's hair. Because I don't really like fooling or messing with their hair too much. Because, like, say it doesn't grow back, and once a hair falls out or whatever, it's gone forever. So, 
so I always tried not to play in their hair too too much and that's why with my boys I always put hats on them so I can't see their hair if it gets messed up but here's his hair I know it looks kind of wild and see how his side of his face is kind of shiny from that stuff Try to just kind of dab it in his ear and stuff. So I'm gonna, that's going in the trash right now. I'm gonna stop using that. Especially because I'm already worried for Alex. There, that's better because of his finger is starting to lose paint and such. So I just don't want to do anything to ruin him or mess him up or anything because. I can no longer send my babies off to be fixed by their artists anymore because she doesn't fix reborn her dog fix the reborns anymore. And so if anything were to happen to my older babies, they're just gonna have to just be that way. I am so picky when it comes to their hair. It's just like, ugh. Delta Dawn. That's where this other, where the other hair I've gotten came from. He has Delta Dawn. And I do believe Briar has Delta Dawn. And, um, well, all I know is whatever hair Briar has, Alex has the same hair. And that hair was the same hair as Annalise. And Annalise's hair is Delta Dawn. So, obviously, these three, they have Delta Dawn hair. But, um, my little princess is going to have Slumberland. I think that's going to be my first time trying Slumberland mohair. Okay, let's try to put this little monster hat on and let's see what we got. Try to balance him up there. <laughs> so I don't think he's going to balance. Ugh. All right, there. Ah. Alex, you're being a little wiggle worm. I know this video is uber long, 30 minutes almost. Let's see, oops. Like I said, I'm just so serious about my baby's hair. I don't like their hair getting messed up. up his hair let's see oh man Ugh. oh that was difficult let's see there <laughs> there's little bolts on the side of his head and I like to have just a little piece of hair sticking out so he's got some room at the top so Here's my little monster man. He has a little, I don't know, is it Eddie monster or something like that? He has that hat on with a different type of green monster on his butt and on his feet and such. So that was Alex's um, outfit of the day video. Mm, I tell you, is there something special and magical about these babies? They're so sweet, so cute. <sighs> Even though they don't breathe or cry or wiggle. And in my opinion, that's a good part. They're one of the good things about them. That they don't do all that stuff. So, I need to modify those little monster pacifiers. I think I'll do that real quick.
and I'll maybe come back a little bit later we'll see I know I haven't been really making videos lately uh, it's not that I haven't well it has been kind of like that I haven't really been in the mood and that stems from not having time and just life just being hectic and such so so that's that um let me see all right i just want to thank you guys for watching these like i said i, I just haven't been doing very good with videos lately i'm gonna post this but it's just not my best i just i don't know i'm just kind of i'm just kind of somewhere else i kind of more like to just enjoy my babies on my own mostly now lately simply because it's just I don't have that much time with them and when I do have time with them I like for it to just be personal and just intimate and just enjoying just my babies by myself and stuff so I tell you one thing it would be kind of cool to have a friend in the community that stayed here that was like that like the dolls like I do, that has them, collects them, buys clothes. It would be kind of cool to have a reborn mommy dolly day, take the babies out shopping, like over the summer or something, or during my Christmas break when I'm off or something like that. It'd be kind of cool. That is one thing about being kind of secluded, isolated with the hobby. If it's just you and you don't have anyone in your family that really you know likes the dolls and it's not that they don't like them it's just not their thing no one asks about them whenever people come up to the house no one has ever asked to see my nursery or anything no one's ever asked and i still think part of my family thinks i'm crazy i don't know why but i don't know you just got to be in it to understand it i guess and the fact that they're not in the hobby, they don't understand the beauty of it. So, it's just something so cool about these dolls. And I just think they're the sweetest thing. They're the sweetest, sweetest, sweetest thing. But, that's it. I'm out of here. I'm going to get um, Peanut dressed over there in his... Um, Halloween outfit and yeah I think that's about it it's 222 this is amazing how fast like a day off goes it's just amazing how quickly it just goes by anyway I'm just gonna try to relax a little bit more and just